but not surprised. Thank you. You got it. All right, Cody, did you want to ask a question? Sure, thank you. How are you doing today? Good morning, Cody. Um, so I know you're limited what you can tell us and all that, but what can you tease? First off, congrats on season two. I know that's a, such Thanks, an exciting man. thing. Um, yeah, so no looking doubt. ahead, what are you hoping to see as the season, you know, now that you know season two is in, in, in the works and all that, what are you looking forward to kind of further establishing with the, your character as we kind of continue on this journey? Yeah, um, you know, I think that we've uh, all seen um, that Mike ha has some internal issues on some level, uh, as do most of the characters uh, on the show. Um, I think we're going to, well, I know we're going to discover a lot more about why he is the way he is, um, you know, and having had conversations with Chris, our showrunner, even before we knew we were going to have the second season pick up officially, um, there was a lot of confidence and hopeful confidence that, that we'd have a, a, um, more of an opportunity to, uh, tell more stories here and knowing where he wants to take things with Mike, I'm super excited about, we're going to learn a lot more about what makes Mike tick. And he may not be the, um, the asshole for the reason that everyone thinks he's an asshole. Um, he may be a lovable asshole. <laughs> so we may come to, I, we're going to come to discover. I think we tapped on a little, a little bit when we saw some of the moments with his father uh, and seeing um, how his father is uh, a lot like him uh, or is he a lot like his father? Um, and he may come to discover that um, he doesn't have to be like his father. So you know, we're going to go down some roads that I think are going to be um, exciting for me uh, as an actor and for the audience when it comes to his journey that we're about to embark upon. Awesome. Thanks. Great. Dana, did you have a question? Yes, I was wondering throughout this good entire, morning, good morning, throughout this entire first season, was there a particular scene, either not yours or someone else's, that you would, that you really loved to explore or wish you could have explored as a character? Uh, is there a scene that I wish that I could have explored that as was, a character? That was someone else's in the show. Oh, that was someone else's scene. Um, you know, gosh, there are so many. There's so many uh, great performances for for different reasons. Some of them for comedic reasons. Some of them for dramatic reasons. Um, you know, Asta's reveal with uh, with Jay in front of her family, uh, with Sarah and Harry having that moment laying in the hay um, together was just beautiful. I don't know that that I would have fit in there um but that stands out to me as like one of those moments where even as a, a person who an actor on the show i'm still impressed by um by the show and what some of our our talented people uh on the show do um trying to think if i've answered your question um i mean i kind of you know, th this past week in particular with uh, Sarah and Alan down in the glacier and with Alice um, uh, on the glacier as well. Her, her work this past week was really outstanding as well. I mean, I mean, to applaud everybody. I mean, uh, Elizabeth Bowen's been absolutely incredible as Deputy Liv. I think the, the dynamic between um, the two of them um, has been just outstanding and so much fun and and we're going to get some resolution on uh their relationship and the difficulties that they've been having uh this evening um i mean not this evening on this week's episode um but there's been a lot of incredible performances judah preen has been incredible as well as max and and grace is um as sahar there's um levi and meredith playing ben and kate i mean it's everybody i think it's this kismet magical thing where Everybody understands who they are, their characters in the show, and everyone takes their moments uh, as those characters and just runs with them. We're lucky. We have a, a very talented group of people um, who are committed to trying to make um, this the best show that we can. 
I don't feel like I answered your question. I feel like I said a bunch of words that kind of <laughs> answered your question, you but I'm not hundred percent sure I answered your question. So <laughs> at least I'm being honest about it. Some people would just sit back in the chair after saying all of that and be like, uh -huh, I did it. But I'm like, uh -huh, I don't know if I did it. You did. So, okay. okay. <laughs>